I'm not afraid to use this to defend my home and my family. But you sure as hell don't look like any spacer I've seen before. So let me get this straight. You heard a distress call and you flew all the way down here. What are you, some sort of priest or good Samaritan? I didn't know people like you were real, but I got a heap load of problems. And I'm willing to pay my share for the help. I don't know what game you're playing, but I guess I'm in. Used to be four families that list help set up stakes in this system. We rarely saw eye to eye in the best of times, and believe me true, these ain't the best of times. Spacers started raiding and it's been getting worse. Only a matter of time before they end us all. <laughs> Unless you're willing to help some hard-working, pig-headed settlers out. No arguments here. The Spacers have taken out the family's list satellites, so we can't even talk to each other. Isolate and eliminate a classic tale. You fix the Lopez satellite and I'll open a secure channel and we can sync up and get the lay of the land. And then get all of our satellites operational. It might be I'm getting caught up in the moment. But I actually feel... <laughs> optimistic for once. Thanks. satellites. You do hear me, right? Hello? Now that's a weight off my shoulders. It's gonna take some time dealing with someone competent. I don't suppose you want a job working hydroponics. No one ever says yes to that. <laughs> Once you repair the other satellites, I'll open a channel to the other families.
my ship. Fine. Anna's already signed on, so meet you at the rendezvous. What about when? We can talk about it there. Fine. Remember, my ship. And that's the last of them. Stranger, let's meet up on the mare's ship. I'll square away payment. But I have a feeling this ain't over and there may be further paying work ahead. Charming as ever. First things first, I'm pretty sure the spacers got the winds. No contact with them. All of them? My god. Shit. They were good people. They died. Needlessly. Because we couldn't get our act together. That's rich coming from you. You've scammed me time and time again, Albin. The spacers are a threat to us all, Jackie. And that, that is the salient point. Mistakes were made, we need to get past that. What I'm proposing is a mutual defense pact, nothing else. Each of us throws in our ships, men, materials, and whatnot, enough to protect all of our asses. I wouldn't give you one solitary ounce of Helium-3 if my life depended on it. The problem is, it does. I think we all need to cool off. Stranger. A word? First things first. You did an honest day's work, you deserve an honest day's pay. Here. With heartfelt compliments. But I expect you know what's coming next. We're not military folk, and I'm not ashamed to say we are out of our depth. I'll pay you more, much more. If you can help kick the spacers out of our system, for good, and coordinate our efforts to do so. <laughs> you, you are something else. So we're not babes in the woods. Each family has a ship or two and hard men and women that can handle themselves in a firefight. But the root of the problem is, admittedly, a self-inflicted injury. My family was here first, and when Lys sent other families here, Perhaps I didn't take to it kindly. Might be I made an odd credit here or there at their expense. Something Lemaire especially has never let me live down. But now we need the Lemaires and the Bandas both, I reckon. I wouldn't hold my breath with Jackie. But Bandas good folk. Well, hopefully. We need to cooperate now. But also in the future. We need a mutual defense pact. As our new mercenary commander, please talk with Band and Lemaire. Lemaire, God help us, especially we could use. The family's got the most ships and crew by far. But if she's a lost cause, Ben and I can muddle through. Just so you know, Albin is a con man and a thief. Associating with the likes of him reflects poorly on your character. Don't be so certain. So here's the deal. Odds are good my crew can hold out against the spacers all by ourselves. If we're gonna band together, I have the most to contribute and the most to lose. The smart play for my interests is the Lemaire's hunker down and outlast the storm. You think that would cover it? My whole family almost died because of him. Five times that much. Final offer. And if you think Albin can repay you, you're dreaming. Albin doesn't deserve you. Not sure any of us do. But the Lemaires are in your defense pact. Now it's your job to make sure we survive this fiasco. Band together. Not only can we Hello, stranger. Your work in getting the satellites up? You've done us a good turn. I know it was paying work, but a lot of mercs wouldn't even take a list contract. You here to talk about the defense pack? 
I figured he might. I mean, I agree that right now coming together makes sense, but going forward, it's hard to imagine Jackie and Alvin working together for the long haul without one winding up with a knife in the back. If you say so. Well, the bandits will join the defense pack. We got one ship operational, another we can patch up. It's not much, but you'll have us when you need us. So is the defense packed in business? Come on, don't keep me in suspense. You convinced Jackie? And now I do believe in miracles. How in the hell did you manage that? I guess there's no need to know how the sausage gets made this time. So, the sensors have picked up two contact groups. Undoubtedly, our spacer friends. We don't have many ships, but we can send them with you. Or hold them in reserves, your call. You are a wonder to behold. After you deal with the spacers, meet back on my farm. I've got an idea how to find where the spacers are based. to hear you back, safe and sound. Banda, you owe me 30 credits. You're tougher than I thought. Easy money. So while you were doing that, I used the communication satellites to triangulate some spacer's chatter. You did what? I'm more than just a pretty face. Anyway, there's an old derelict star station the spacers are using as a base. Couldn't say it better myself. There are undoubtedly a lot of spacers there, both ships and men on the station itself. We need to excise this cancer from our system. Every last one of them. 100% agree. So, O oh glorious leader, any words of wisdom or inspiration before we embark? This is it. The big one. We need to bring everything we got to bear. There won't be any do-overs on this one. We'll all be waiting for you to jump in. Start boarding the star station. It's time to reclaim this system. 
This? This is the first deep breath I've taken in months. I make no illusions. You did this. And now it's up to us to keep it going. Very diplomatic. It's horseshit, of course. But it sounded nice. The rest of the families and I, well, uh, we chipped in for a reward. I know it's probably a pittance compared to what someone like you makes. But, uh, we're just dirt poor farmers and miners just trying to get by. I think I need to shut up. I... I'm not... Yeah, deep breath. If you ever are in this system, you come back and visit. We'll give you a warm welcome for the ages. <laughs>